Mira, Royal Detective. Let's hear it for Mira, Royal Detective. Mira, Mira, Mira. The richness of this world, getting to collaborate mm -hmm. who with people who come from a common cultural experience. What? Yeah. How does that compare to other roles you've taken on? I have had the opportunity of being part of movies um, uh, that are from the country that I come from. Yeah. And so, you know, I started off at Slumdog Millionaire, even though it was made by a British filmmaker, we had an all Indian cast. Why this one feels a little more different is because this one gets viewed and consumed at a very, very early age. Yeah, I can feel it in my gut. Oh wait, that's just my stomach growling. I was gonna say, this show. This show. This show brings up a very important issue, which is Mongoose representation. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Finally, someone gets it. I... This is why you hired a variety. Thank you for getting a professional. Party! Mongoose style. Mongooses have been woefully uh, underrepresented as I far as so. cartoon animal sidekicks are concerned. I think I may be the first one, which is sad. And, uh, you know, but somebody has to be the first and they have to sort of like, pioneer and move through and I think Cal and I really took on a huge burden playing mongooses. This is the greatest thing that's ever happened to me. I think something beautiful about the show is that it, it depicts South Asian culture in such a beautiful colorful way you know you're exposed to Indian dancing and food and different terms that you wouldn't get with other shows. This is going to expose young kids to South Asian culture and hopefully help them normalize our culture. We'll take in the I think one of the brilliant things that the, the makers of the show did was they really researched, you know, while making it fun and while making it binge-worthy entertainment for kids, they did really pay attention to detail, right from the clothes that she's wearing or the food that they talk about, like laddus and whatnot. Like, all of that is just well-researched. And I really like that we didn't have to whitewash it to make it palatable. What do you mean by that? Like, we didn't have to kind of change it to burgers, you know, just so that every, yeah. every kid gets understands what a burger is or candy. What, do. what do you hope young kids, especially young kids of South Asian descent, get from watching this? You know, I just hope that they feel a little bit normal. Like they don't feel other. You don't look around and go, nobody on TV looks like me. You have a reference point where you can be like, but Mira is there. And her culture and my culture and my grandparents' culture and my parents' culture is represented on television, which means I belong here and it's okay to be here and in fact it's pretty normal you know just to feel a part of aside from them looking like me i mean this is a cast of people that i've grown up watching my entire life and the fact that i get to say i'm in episodes with people like Cal Penn, Frida Pinto, people that I've idolized my entire life, not just because they look like me, but because they're super talented. I think this is definitely a monumental show. We're on the case. Hey, hey. I love the idea of including the aunties and the uncles. So in your best uncle voice, give me your best uncle advice. Probably like get a good tax guy. Like who's doing your taxes? Did you know you can write that off? Did you know you can write that off? Is probably the uncle quote. That's the one. I'll tell you something really funny. Growing up, if you call someone an auntie in India, you've aged them terribly. <laughs> terribly. Well, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> <laughs> so when you, you know, have younger nieces and nephews, it would right. always be my intention to say, just call me Frida, call me Frida, just <laughs> yeah. so that I don't get aged. Right. Um, because an auntie is not an aunt. Let's be, let's correct. And part of that is the aunties and uncles give you unsolicited they advice. They do, yes, yeah. yeah. So what would be my unsolicited? Yeah, yeah, what's your, what's your auntie advice? Don't talk to strangers. Yeah, that would be, <laughs> that would be, advice. yeah, that's, <laughs> that's always the one that you always get in. Don't <laughs> yeah. talk to strangers on your way to school. Let's hear it for Mira, 